Hello. One Ayanza. Hey Alright, today let's take a look at a variety of different things. We don't know what we're doing. I'm trying to turn the TV down a little bit so we don't get affected. Alright, here we go. We're going to start out with the backs of jerseys. Now, this is my uh, flea market finds from four the weekend of four seven and the weekend of four this past weekend Easter weekend four twenty one. So I forgot a couple weeks ago. So this is Tony Womack, the starter. Everything is stitched. This was a replica. Next is a replica. Troy Palomalo, 2006. All pro jersey. Replica, which means all silk screened. I'm not doing like a gigantic show of this or anything like that, but I will show what I got because I heard a couple people tell me, hey, that's cool. Do it again. Okay, Troy Palomalo Steelers away jersey, once again. This is a replica, which means everything is silk screened. I'm not telling you where I get this stuff from. Ooh, the goat. There we go. With a finished this jersey 2012. So, I had a authentic one of these. Probably have a video of it. That's a replica. Throwback. Not sure. Ricky Henderson, Oakland A's. This is on the wall, so I'm not sure if this was when time frame this was. But if it was done already, sorry. I got mixed up in weeks. This one, I believe, is a 2XL. Ricky Henderson replica. Doesn't have any tags in it, but measures out to be a 2XL. There's a starter jersey. A Neil O'Donnell one. This one has a silk screened hands, arms. So, see, starter 44. So, this is a nice little find when it comes down to it. There you have it. Next one, Walter Payton. This is a premier throwback jersey, probably from the Gridiron Classic. Let's see. Yep, Gridiron Classic. So, everything is stitched on in a single layer. Silk screen. Stitched. Silk screen. Throwback. I think it's 85. Yeah, 1985 throwback. Nice jersey find. Next, another Palomalo. Shit, load up on these. I'll be going to the Hall of Fame within a year or two. This is a premiere, which means stitched on letters and numbers and the silk screened arms. Kind of like that water painting one. This one's an XL. There you go. Next one up. This, I just got in on Saturday, on, what is this, 23rd, 22nd, 23rd, that's the 20th. This one I already had, but it didn't have the brister on the back. It had the name bar on the back, but not the brister, so, um, nowadays this would be considered a premier jersey or a, what is it, you know, Reebok terms. Limited, I guess this would be if you were doing Nike terms, but nice little find a little while ago, and I sent this to my customizer to get Brister stuff back on. It's an old Russell Athletic, so that's 46. And then I got a couple, and I didn't bring some in, so I got a Battis that I had done. This would have been for 2002 through 2004. Jersey, this is authentic. Sleeves are good to go. 
material. Next you have Pittsburgh Pirates t-shirt of was it Tony Watson with the Giants I think he was here this past weekend. T-shirt can use be threaded but it's a size small and Reeboks jerseys, so I'm getting these done. And uh, certain players, like you saw with the Bettis, this one I did a Connor. They're all legit jerseys. I got them from a dealer that was uh, an old sports store that went out and they used to customize jerseys. So he had these blank ones from it. So there you go. Oh, what's that? Another Connor. One's a size 48 and one's a size of 50. So this one is the 50. This one actually just sold. I gotta get this upstairs and send it off. Everything's stitched on. Made in Korea. These jerseys are also 2002 through 2004 Reebok. And then finally, the last one that I had made. And this came in Saturday. Like I said, I got a bunch of them in. So. TJ Watt. And these were blank with the name bars, so it makes it easier to do. And I get to charge cheaper, but hey, still good to go. Some people like the Reebok version instead of the Nike version. So, there you have it. Now you know. There's some more jerseys that I got. So, before we go, a couple more things that I got. Hulk Hogan, haha, <laughs> wrong, the Incredible Hulk, Pirates gave this away in 2018, it's a bobblehead, see, Hulk bobblehead, I haven't uh, looked through it yet, and then finally, since we had a bunch of Troy Palomalas around, here's a Troy Palomalas draft day bobble, I got drafted for the Steelers. So, I got one me, one of these. Because, like I said, Hall of Fame pretty soon. Which means the original stuff better than... I mean, why would you want a Troy Nike jersey? <clears throat> when you can get an original. So, there you go. Ping. Finally. Ping is in the video so all right thank you